Hello. Look at this thing. It is, I don't know if you can see this there, but it says an extreme value. I don't know if it's extreme or not, but Detective Pokichu. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Greninja GX. Uh, yeah, let me flip this little thingy up here. Uh, looks like we get it a handful of packs from Detective Pikachu. Uh, one special edition card, one giant special edition card, and uh, a couple of other booster packs in there. Oh, and a pen. Look, we get a little pen. Yeah, can't really get it on camera. Oh, there it is. But before we open this, I know what you're saying. I gotta crack this open real quick. Uh, yeah, I was there and I figured, hey, these are only, you know, these are pretty cheap. So I've got a few of these, so you get some bonus content with this video. But what we'll do is, I'll just pull these out of the packaging here real quick. And then we'll start cracking open the, uh, the Pikachu. And some of y'all who talk with me over in Discord, the Discord channel is down in the description. Um, I had mentioned that I wasn't really wanting to buy any more Pokemon stuff because uh, the sealed product is, is pretty decent. It has decent value, but once you open the packs, uh, the value of the cards is just, uh, yeah, it's just, it's just not there. Um, I still find that to be true, but I got a really good deal on these, so I figured why not, and plus I can use this to make a video. So, we got six boosters here. Let me set these aside real quick. Let's crack open our Detective Pikachu thing. Let me see how I do this. Okay, let's tear this open. Oh. And I imagine this has a ton of plastic, just as they always do. Let's see if we can... Hmm. Well, the box is nice. It's got some interesting stuff in it. But it's getting recycled. Man, there's so much plastic in these things. All right, let's see, what do we got here? Oh, we got a code, which I'm definitely using, so sorry. Uh, there we go. Man, so much plastic. All getting recycled. Let's take a look at this card. At least this one's in pretty good shape. Sometimes when I get these cards um, out of these special edition boxes, they come a little dinged up. So I'm happy that this one is in pretty good shape. Can feel the cutting edges here too. Kind of interesting. And then there's my code for the card. Put that right over there. Okay. Let's see what else we got here. Look at this thing. And then of course we got the giant version of it. Can is this is this tournament legal? Can I use this in a <laughs> that's kind of neat actually. And put that over on my bookcase. So we'll put you over there. Let's see, one, two packs, three, four packs of Detective Pikachu. And, oh wait, hold on. Did I miss a pack? No, wait. Oh, there's five packs. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Nice. Five packs. I thought I was only getting four. Okay. Uh, and then we get a, what is this, Sun and Moon? And then we got Sun and Moon Crimson Invasion. Ooh, what is this? Oh, oh hold on. Let me get my pen. Gotta get my pen. I actually kind of like these. These are kind of neat. I hear that there is a whole slew of people who actually collect these. Um, I've got a few of them now, so who knows? Let me put this back over here on the bookshelf. And it looks like, oh cool, I got an, an interesting little... What is this? Oh, okay, I think it's just for cards. Uh, it's just a card binder. Let me put that plastic over here. <laughs> oh, wow. This thing has a smell to it. Ooh, that's a... Uh... Wow, that's <laughs> it's, it's very plasticky. Yeah, not uh, super high grade stuff, but you know, it's it's you know, it is what it is. I still kind of like it though. It's got the Detective Pikachu stuff on it. Somebody will want this. Could probably sell this, you know, somebody. But until then, this will definitely go back on the bookshelf. One of these days, I'm going to share more pictures on the bookshelf, and you all can see all the junk that I have there. Okay, so um, one, two, three, four, five Detective Pikachu's. Um, one regular Sun and Moon, one Sun and Moon in Crimson Invasion, and then of course I've mentioned these packs here earlier. Here, we'll open these packs first, and then we'll move on. Actually, you know, let's do Detective Pikachu first. Let me make some room here. Wow, too many packs. 
Okay, stay there. Let's open up some Detective Pikachu. Last time I opened up some of these packs, I actually got some good stuff. I got uh, Mewtwo's, I got Charizard, which is the most valued card. It's about a $4 card. Um, so if I can get a couple of Charizards, um, that will actually pay for this box. <laughs> That'd be nice. Let's see what we got here. Oh, I see a Bulbasaur in my future. Get over there. We got a Bulbasaur. Lick tongue, Snubble, and Machamp. There's my code. I'm keeping my code. Can't have my code. Okay, cards here. All right, next one. So nothing amazing out of that pack. Uh, the Mr. Mime and the Charizard are the most valued, I believe. The Mewtwo is kind of up there too, uh, but it's Charizard and then Mr. Mime, I believe. And let's see. Yep, that's my code again. Oops, you stay there. What we got here? I think I see a Mewtwo in my future. More lol. <laughs> Another Bulbasaur. Magikarp. And oh, it's a Mr. Mime. Okay, not bad. I think I've got a bunch of these already, though. I think I got like three of these. So Mr. Mime, not bad. I apologize. My my game mat that I'm using today isn't actually flat. It's kind of crinkly. When I, I bought it online for really cheap. And uh, the guy sent it to me in this really crap packaging. <laughs> and uh, it got crinkled up. Um, I mean, it's still nice. It feels nice and everything, but it's got these really hard... Anyways. Uh, another bubble sore that's... Uh, wow, okay. Another look at tongue, another snowball, and ditto. Okay. Nothing amazing. Again, Charizard. Or another Mr. Mime would be good. Prefer Charizard. I'm not getting Charizard. Gosh, this thing is really... All right, where's Blade? Where are you, Blade? Oh, we have scissors. That's right, I'm using scissors. Because I can. Code over here. Jiggly! Uh, another Magikarp. More lol. And hey, a Mewtwo. Mewtwo is worth about three bucks. So that's a pretty good pull there. And last one. Actually, here I'll just save myself the trouble. But you might cut the cards! No, there's enough room in the pack. Don't worry about it. Should be fine. Should be fine. Let's see another Jigglypuff in my future. And we got ourselves a Jiggly. Oh. A Charmander. Oh, is that a Charizard in the back? It is not. It is an Arcanine. Um, I don't know how much this little guy's worth. He's a cool card, though. Um, so a little disappointed with the detect. Wow, look at that. Yeah. Anyways, a little disappointed with the Detective Pikachu. Um, only got one Mr. Mime. Did get a Mewtwo. Uh, no Charizards, though. Um, there's the Mr. Mime. Uh, some of these will probably be going up on the card store, so if you're interested in any of them, give them a look there. Put those aside. Okay, so which are we doing first? I am going to go with the regular Sun and Moon. Yeah, these are a little tighter. I'm going to get my scissors back over here. I'm being careful. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, I hit a card. Oh no, we're in trouble. I'm kidding. got ourselves a polywog or a polywag. Polywag, uh, Skarmory. Uh, more lol again. Formantis. Oh, let's see some Spiro. What do we got here? Wishy washy, reverse foil, and then we've got a foil dug trio. <laughs> a Lolan. <laughs> Look, the hair. The hair is hilarious. Okay. Uh, we got our, our own commons. Eradicate, experience, share, good card. And Palipper. Alright. And let's just move right onto this one. God, these, I really do not like opening some of these boosters. They're just not easy to open. Especially the, the, the Pokemon ones, they, they don't leave a lot of room. So you have to be a little careful when you're opening them. Uh-oh. Does this one already have a ding on it? Oh, no. I don't think it does. Sw Swinub. Numel. Mencino. 
I don't even know what that means. Miss Drivus, uh, Alolan Geodude, <laughs> uh, Shellos, and uh, Registeel. I've actually never seen this guy. Um, is he good? Um, he's a basic 130 hit points. Turbo Arm and Iron Hand. If Regis is on your bench, heal 30 damage from this Pokemon. That's actually not bad. Kind of expensive for a retreat, but mm, let's see how that is. Uh, let's see for our Uncommons, Diggersby, uh, Hakamo'o, and Counter Catcher. So nothing super amazing out of those boosters. Let us move on to our three Sword and Shield. Again, we're using scissors, because why not? Oh, I don't think I cut it enough, did I? Okay, that's good enough. I see Pikachu! Yes, it's Pikachu. What do we got here? So we got ourselves Pikachu. Uh, Sinisty. Wooloo. I've seen some bad stuff about Wooloo. Not gonna say. Shelter. Uh, Groa Gunk. <laughs> Clobopus and a land a lantern. I've actually never seen this one. Okay. Our energy over here, and for our uncommons, Quillfish, uh, <laughs> the Pokey Kid, uh, and an energy search. Uh, that's not bad. I actually don't mind getting those trainer cards. I feel like I don't really get very many of them, so it's always kind of nice to get one. I'm making a mess over here. You do not want to see my floor right now. <laughs> there is just wrapping all over the place. Goldine. Diglett. Scroopy. Ho Hoot Hoot. Score Bunny. And then we've got uh, a Salandit Reverse. And a Snorlax. <laughs> oh gosh, I don't like him. Uh, Mantine, good card. Crushing Hammer, not bad. Switch. Alright. Sword and Shield's not being too friendly today. It's just like, oh, I'm just going to give you some very basic stuff. See, this is what I was talking about, how the sealed product, especially for, for Pokemon right now, the sealed product is good, uh, meaning that, I mean, like this booster, you could take it and sell it for four bucks. Somebody will give you four bucks for it eventually. Uh, but once you open that pack, um, you just don't know. I mean, if you get a great card, great. It pays for the pack at least. It, but the chances of you getting that amazing card are a little low. Oh, look at that. Metal Saucer. It's the reverse. I actually got the secret rare of that one. That's the reverse foil. And then, oh, look at this, Inteleon. The only thing about this is I actually already have this card. <laughs> But that's kind of neat looking. I like the foiling on that. So that'll probably go up for sale. Uh, Beedy or Bede. Hitmanly. And a rare candy. All right. Last three boosters. All darkness ablaze. Come on. Can we get a nice, pretty card here? We've opened up enough boosters. Got to give me something here. Come on. Come on, Pokemon gods. Give me something. Something amazing, I beg you. Shelmet, <laughs> Panpour, Ted Tedarusi, uh, Rookadee, uh, Trapinch, Combus Combuskin. <laughs> I love that guy. He's goofy. Uh, reverse foil, and then Mr. Rhyme, Galarian Mr. Rhyme. Interesting card. I've never seen this one. I've heard of him. Uh, never seen him though. Energy, and then we get a Steeny, uh, a, a Deden, and Vibrava. Uh, still nothing super pretty, and I know you all know what I mean by super pretty. Gotta get some secret rares going here, man. Get some of those crazy looking Insano cards that I see all over the internet that are selling for like, you know, 20, 30 bucks. Uh, I've actually only gotten one really expensive card. Well, it wasn't even that expensive, it was the Metal Saucer. <laughs> And it still hasn't sold. It's still sitting there on my store. Uh, Golet, Phoebus. Perloin. Yeah, Perloin. Hippopotus. Hippopotus. Okay. Sin Street. Carablast. 
and muck. <laughs> oh gosh. Uh, energy. Old PC. Interesting card. Oops, I put these in the wrong spot. You go over here. Oops. There we go. Old PC. Ariados. And another Doug Trio. Last pack, guys. Thanks for checking out the video. Again, most of these cards will probably end up on my card store, which should be linked in the description if it's not there. Uh, I definitely know that in the description is my uh, Discord channel. You can head over to the Discord channel and we'll definitely direct you over to the card store in case you feel like buying cards. And a lot of my stuff isn't terribly expensive. So, yeah, it's a good way to uh, help me out. Dinio! Uh, pass... Passamian? <laughs> Bunnelby, Velonite, uh, Gothica, Panseer for the reverse, and a Vanillux. Yep, nothing amazing. Uh, oh, powerful energy. Good one. Uh, Toxapex, <laughs> and a Clang. Hey, Clang's kind of neat. Uh, anyways, thanks for checking out the video, guys. Uh, again, a lot of this will end up on the store. And until next time.